Assalamu alaikum. Hope you are doing fine. We know whenever there is a change in the magnetic flux linked with the coil or conductor, an EMF is induced in that coil or conductor. As a result, the induced current flows in that conductor. When the induced current do not find path to leave the conductor, it keeps circulating in the same conductor. We call such a circulating or looping current as eddy current. In this video, we are going to learn about eddy current with the help of few experiments. To demonstrate the formation of eddy current, in a conductor, I have taken two aluminum caskets. They are suspended with the help of enameled copper wire. I bring this uh, new diamond magnet near to this aluminum gasket. You can see it do not get attracted by this uh, new diamond magnet. It shows that it is uh, a non-magnetic substance. Now for better visibility, I slightly move this uh, arrangement. Now. I will keep this neodymium magnet within the gasket and I slowly move this magnet to and fro. You could hear carefully what happened. You can observe the gasket has started moving. This is due to the formation of a current in this gasket. When I move the magnet by keeping very near to it, the magnetic flux linked with the gasket changes. As a result, an EMF is induced in the gasket, which results in induced EMF. When the induced EMF flow in this gasket, do not find a path to leave the gasket. So it keeps circulating in this gasket. We call that circulating induced current as a D current. As a result, due to magnetic effect of current, it behaves like a magnet, so it gets attracted by the new double magnet. So it moves. Now I will repeat the same with this gasket. Here I have made a small change to this gasket. What I have done, I have made a small cut here. You can see I pass this card through this gasket. There is a slit here. Now I repeat the same thing which I did with this gasket. Now good here, I keep it inside. I move it to and fro. You can observe no oscillation in this gasket. It is for the reason that there is no complete path for the flow of ED current. So it doesn't behave like a magnet. Now I will perform one more experiment to demonstrate the formation of ED current in a metal. For that I take a, an aluminum channel. Through this I drop a, a steel cylinder. Look at this carefully how it moves. Place it here. You better observe the steel cylinder moves very fast through this aluminum channel. Now, I take a new devil magnet, more or less of the same size of that steel cylinder. Now place it here. I move. Now look at this, how it moves. I repeat this once again. You can observe how smoothly and slowly it moves. I do it once again. Look at this, the movement. You may observe 
it moves up very slowly. It is due to the formation of a D current in the aluminum channel. When this magnet moves within this aluminum channel, the magnetic flux linked with the aluminum channel changes. As a result, an EMF is induced here. That results in the formation of a D current. So it behaves like a magnet and slows down the motion of the new domain magnet. I hope uh, this video is useful. If you have any kind of doubt related to the topic, kindly put your questions in the comment section. Thanks for watching.